Tropical storm Harvey has its eyes on Texas and Louisiana, and that has emergency officials and residents getting ready. CBS 4's Lauren Pastrana joins us now with more. Lauren? Elliot, the rush to get ready for a possible hurricane is on. In Texas, the governor already has state rescue and recovery resources on standby to be deployed on or near the coast if needed. They're filling sandbags and clearing store shelves ahead of Harvey's arrival along the Texas coastline. Water and food and batteries and flashlights. You got to have your spam <laughs> and cans of chili, tuna. Water, uh, food, just getting ready for it. Texas Governor Greg Abbott has ordered the state operations center to elevate its readiness level, and he's preemptively declared a state of disaster for 30 counties. We've got all of our drainage crews out. We're getting all the ditches cleared. We're trying to get all the drain inlets cleared. That's a major concern in a low-lying city like Galveston. We're going to start seeing tidal run up this evening, and when we start getting anywhere from a two to four foot tide with any kind of uh, inundating rains, it causes severe uh, street flooding problems for us because the streets just can't drain. Businesses are bracing for flooding. Artist Derek Anderson is prepping his studio by getting everything off the floor, especially his paintings. Yeah, I don't want to ruin it. You know, uh, Ike ruined a few of them, so, you know, I don't need to have any more damage done. I'm trying to make him away and not give him swimming lessons. Lines are long at gas stations in Corpus Christi. I want to top up the gas just in case we have to get up and go. But for some still on summer vacation, they say they're not going anywhere. Not even a looming storm will change their plans. We're staying down here all week. We're going to party right through the hurricane. Texas, though, isn't the only state in the storm's path. Southern Louisiana is also preparing for the storm, which is expected to possibly become a hurricane by tomorrow. Lauren Pastrana, CBS 4 News. Elliot? Wish the best for those folks. Lauren, thank you. Chief Meteorologist Craig Setzer is tracking Harvey and our local weather. You'll have the very latest starting tonight on CBS 4 News at 5. And remember, you can track storms on the radar and get alerts at any time on the CBS Miami Weather app. Download it to your iPhone or Android. You can find it in the iTunes Store or the Google Play Store.